All right, so while we're in Maine, we had to come to Portland. Portland. So add this to your list. Uh, we are in Portland. We're going to go to the Head Lighthouse. We found some parking in downtown, which is not easy with a dually. <laughs> Forty-four dollars for parking for uh, t until two a.m. Yeah, still. I mean, it's nice parking. The smell. It's a. Uh, it's next to the fish market. There's a lot of seafood left over in that area, but um, we're heading to Luke's, right? Luke's Lobster Shack. Lobster. Lobster. Um, it's supposed to be the best lobster rolls in the area. Yeah. Um, so we're gonna go check it out. Yep, we're gonna go check it out and then we're gonna um, go see the lighthouse, right? All right, so let's get a lobster roll. Yes. If they have gluten free, of course. If not, I guess you're just eating lobster. Yep. So we're at Luke's Lobster House. Lobster Shack. Lobster Shack. It's supposed to be a really good place. And when we walked up, I think the line proves it. The line is like out the door. The line is out the door, but that's just the line to get to the table. To like put your name for table. Right. And then there's people waiting for tables. But you do have a bar up top that you can go hang out in too. Yeah. So, so, and it's really pretty on the back side. It's three levels. Uh, the down level is like on the dock and that's seating outside under some uh, like umbrellas. Mm -hmm. which is, so it's, it's nice and cool and with the breeze coming off the water. And then you come up the stairs and that's where you put your name in at the table and then for the table. And then there's a seating area there and then you go upstairs and there's seating area there. Right. So it's, it's pretty big. I believe it's good. Wait a while. Yeah, someone actually ordered takeout and then just sat out here and ate. So, so that's an option. So that's an option if you're in a hurry. Yeah. But it's only like 15, 20 minutes for like a table for four. Um, so it's not bad wait. Not even, for us. even though it's really crowded, but there's 13 of us. Yeah. So, so it's more like an hour wait. Yep. But we heard it's worth it, so we're gonna try it. Yep. We'll then go to the lighthouse. We'll let you know what it's like. Yep. Did you enjoy your food? I but you only she had fried pickles. That's all she eats. She doesn't eat any seafood. But I went for you. Did you enjoy your food? Absolutely See? enjoyed it. So then it was worth it. Now it you was have great. To go get me some type of dessert so it was, you can actually feel full. It was great food and it wasn't super expensive. I mean, it's still expensive, but not compared to other places we've been. Right. It was pretty good. For to be in a touristy area, yep. they could have jacked their prices up. Yep. Oh gosh, it kept bright. It got really bright. Uh, All right. Sorry. Add that one to your list. Ready? 
They're there. They're there. We're at the Portland Head Lighthouse. Yes. You can't see the lighthouse. It's so foggy. <laughs> the fog rolled in. Yeah. It's, and it was just a beautiful clear day. Yep. Until we were sitting there eating and then all of a sudden this like cloud rolled in. Yeah. One thing about Maine, um, if, if you don't already know, bring layers because one minute it's sunny and 75 hot, degrees when we left. And, and then all of a sudden you have cold or rain or wind or something there's always something so bring bring layers if you haven't learned that well, already we're gonna get a unique perspective because last time we were here it was nice and clear yes now we're gonna see it in the fog and they haven't turned the light on nick's like isn't that the point of the light only as if it's an operatable <laughs> <laughs> we don't know if this is still in operation or not. Right, right um but there is also no service here either so it says that you can use the the app to pay for parking but you can't get the app to load because um, there's no service. Yep, five dollars for two hours of parking. Yeah, so kind of is the minimum. Yep. So we did it the manual way. All right, let's go check out the fort and the lighthouse. United States government took over the responsibility of, the, of all lighthouses and Congress uh, uh, appropriated $1,500 for its completion. So this lighthouse was commissioned by George Washington in 1787, yep. built in 1791. Yeah, it was finished in 1791. Right. And it only cost $2,200. <laughs> yeah, it was like the government gave him 750 bucks to get it done. That wouldn't even like pay for the permits now mm -mm. nope but i mean money back then was a lot smaller yeah. so seashells yeah <laughs> so but it's pretty cool right it is the oldest lighthouse in maine it is it absolutely is it's a beautiful lighthouse for sure and it just it's on that coast it's on the coast it's that picturesque yeah very picturesque scenery it has the uh kind of acadia field on the coastline uh, other than that, that fog rolled in quick. I would yeah. hate to be on the water. Like, just There's just know if you're going to be on the water. Be prepared. That water can, yeah, that fog can roll in quick. And there's actually a little boat out there, and the light is not on. <laughs> so. Okay. Don't go into the shoreline. Oh, it's a, it's a tour boat, so he knows what he's doing. Yeah. But, but anyways. Yep. Well, hope you enjoy the lighthouse, guys. Yeah, uh, sorry about the fog. There's nothing we can do about it. Right but hopefully you enjoy it anyways.